parking lot to diamond status, a brand new luxury resort has just sprouted in the low country at the edge of Mount Pleasant. With the construction of this, their focus really was to have a property that felt local, that felt like a residential high-end beach property rather than a hotel. The beach club at Charleston Harbor Resort and Marina looks like a classic Charleston single with porch-like balconies, only these provide spectacular views of the harbor and downtown steeple-studded skyline. We are one nautical mile from downtown Charleston. I think the location really is the primary factor. Our service levels will compete with any of the best properties in Charleston, if not exceed. The fact that we have a, a spa differentiates us from a lot of different properties. The fact that we have a marina, there's no other hotel here in the Charleston area that has a marina. And a movie theater with 30 Italian leather seats, amenities that have earned it four diamonds and a place in the coveted group leading hotels of the world. The spa is not just for guests. The hotel's five treatment rooms offer a variety of services to the public, from facials to body wraps. And they're all catered to your skin and what you are looking to focus on to help you keep looking young and fresh. All moderately priced. A stay at the hotel will set you back about $250 per night on the low end, but it's a price that gives downtown lodging a run for its money. But having a brand new hotel neighboring the best city in the world is not just a boon to Mount Pleasant's economy. It poses a challenge. And that's the competition. And it's not so much competition for business, it's competition for good employees. And we're very fortunate here at Charleston Harbor Resort that we offer free parking, we offer a family meal, our pay is more than competitive, we have the best benefits of any property I've ever had the pleasure of working for. So when you put all that together, we certainly have some reasons for good people to come work for us. And the future looks bright. Despite a false start opening and closing four days before Hurricane Matthew, the Beach Club is quickly filling its 92-room capacity.